for this for so long I'm so excited I know what's inside you probably know what's inside as well because I spoiled it in the thumbnail but hey <laughs> what do you say old pal should we open what the fuck did you guys hear that shit my fucking RGB LEDs just like blew up. Yo, so I'm just chilling here, watching some PewDiePie over here on the right in his new video, best package I ever received, right? I'm only about 40 seconds in, I hear this pop, and what, what the hell, why are my LEDs dim? What's going on? I heard it from back there, I think it came from the uh, little control box up there that I duct taped to the wall. I heard a pop yesterday, and I heard another one right now, and get this, so it was all the way bright. It just popped and now it's all dim. I try to adjust the brightness. Nothing. Power. Nothing. Nothing works. Spent 30 fucking dollars on these two 16 foot reels. I think some shit popped in there. In this little thing. So that kind of blows. It's this piece of shit right here. One top. Don't buy from them. Also, I've also had some other experience over there. One of the LEDs kind of got dim. Like, I think the, the blue one over there, right here, as you guys can see, hopefully it picks up. Come on, pick up. Pick up. Maybe if I zoom out more. Right there. It's it's yellow, because the blue one just doesn't work right there. Oh no, the red one is dim over there, the blue one doesn't work over there. And there's another blue one that doesn't work right there, so. Don't buy from one top, shit company. Yeah. Gonna have to get some new LEDs, because this is literally my only light source in the room. So, yep. Rip. I'm also gonna have to buy $20 worth of adhesive just to stick these fucking things up, so... My morning's going quite swell. I bought these LEDs like two weeks ago, and I've had constant problems keeping them up. Hooked onto the walls, the adhesive on the back of them is just straight cancer, terrible. They've fallen at least 10 times, probably more, and I'd have to re-stick it back up through with duct tape, scotch tape, shitty duct tape, and uh, some crappy double-sided foam tape. Some weird stuff, and then finally I got the, I finally bought like $20 uh, double-sided uh, Velcro, or whatever, just Velcro, and those seem to be working. They're pretty adhesive, and they stick pretty well up there, so they haven't fallen down for the last, I'd say, week. So, in the meantime of that, also throughout the last two weeks, I've had a few bulbs break as well. Because in each bulb, since it's RGB, in each bulb, there's red, green, and blue. So there's three bulbs in one, practically. And on on one of them I showed you in the video, the red one just completely, uh, I, I guess it, it, it's dimmed. It didn't break completely, but it's dimmed out. And there are two other ones that just completely broke. And I'm looking around my room right now, it's still dim. The only way I can have these on and working is if it's plugged in. And if I had to turn it off, I'd have to unplug the damn things. And, uh, you know, the controller doesn't work anymore, so that kind of sucks. I'm going to try using it now. Yep, it doesn't work. But I'm looking around the room right now, and I'm, I'm looking right next to a few of the broken ones. It seems like it's spreading or something. Like, those ones seems to be dimmed out as well. Almost as if the uh, the green ones broke on those ones. I don't even know. I spent 30 bucks on two 16-foot reels, and well, this is what I get. So I'm probably gonna return these. Hopefully they'll take them back, and hopefully I'll get some actually quality LEDs because these things were awesome. I had this shitty lamp in my room before. It was like a it had like five five little lights on it, like five whatever bulbs, you know, the big bulbs, whatever. Had five of those on it. Yeah, it. it, it it, it may be bright. It wasn't very bright. If it if it was bright, it was only you know bright directed into one area. It, it was terrible. So when I got these LEDs, stuck them up there, put the brightness all the way up, stuck them on white, and it was brighter than my my shitty lamp. So I took that out of here. Don't got that anymore. And I was just I was just left with these LEDs. So I'm gonna have to have a dim ass room for quite a while. Probably. Oh man, this is gonna be this is gonna suck. Cause I'm gonna have to return these and. I'm gonna have to be in a dark room for probably three or four days. That's gonna suck until I get the uh, the new ones. And the plus, I'm gonna go out and buy a uh, uh, twenty more dollars of um, you know the adhesive that I used to stick these ones up. Maybe the new ones I'll get. They'll have better adhesive on the back of them already. So maybe I won't have to purchase that. But yeah, kind of sucks. But that's not the focus of this video. It's just my RGB rant. Instead, the focus is about 
what I want to do on the channel specifically. Now I've done I've done a lot of things on the channel. First originating with like uh, gaming news and then PlayStation news, onto Destiny and then the Division, and a few other things here and there. And recently, you know, I, I don't play the Division anymore. I think it's pretty lame, pretty boring, and yeah, it's just it's just not a great game anymore. And it, it's just got I I, I I'm. I didn't say I didn't really milk it, but I uh, I played it to its full potential. Yeah, there we go. That's the that's the correct saying. I played it to its full potential, and you know it, it, the game's practically over. And yeah, I could go play it again, but I just have no desire to at all. And recently, I've been playing a lot of H1Z1. I've been getting pretty good at that. I'm not quite royalty uh, tier yet. That's the, the highest tier in there. I'm a uh, two two more down from that. I, there it goes royalty diamond. Platinum. I'm platinum right now, about to get into diamond, so hopefully I can get that within a few days. That would be sick. But I also want to release more H1Z1 videos, maybe live stream it a bit more for H1Z1. That game's pretty fun. I just bought Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. It's practically H1Z1, King of the Kill. It's, it's like the same exact game, but I guess more realistic. It's newer, so it's unoptimized and frame rates are complete garbage. I'm gonna have to wait until I get my new CPU in order to play that game and actually, you know, live stream and or make videos on. So I guess that's kind of what I'm doing right now. I don't exactly know what I want with the channel. Like, I when Destiny 2 comes out, I will be playing that, uploading it onto the channel. Like, I'm like 95% sure that'll be happening. I'll also make, uh, you know, news videos about Destiny 2, like updates, like, oh, this is what's happening with Destiny 2. We got some leaked information here over there you know that sort of stuff around destiny 2 just revolving a lot of content around that but also on the channel i want to uh you know bring more funny stuff to the channel more i guess real stuff to the channel instead of these just like oh here's my build video in the division here's here's how you kill bullet king in under two minutes you know tutorials like that i, I, I don't i'm kind of done with tutorials I, I don't know i just want to bring more you know funny content to the channel uh, I uploaded yesterday the H1Z1 funny moments. I thought that was amazing and I'll probably be uploading a few more like that this week So that'd be pretty cool if you guys missed that video it'll be the linked uh, down below and ultimately I just want I want to bring more fun to the channel and You know it, it sucks lately though. I, I want to touch up on something else. I have 6,800 subscribers and I'm just curious where the fuck did everybody go people stop watching the videos and I don't know why I think I make some pretty fucking awesome content and for the people who still watch the videos and support the channel, comments, like videos, and all that stuff, I appreciate you guys. You guys are the true MVPs on this channel. But to the people who have subscribed to the channel and just don't watch the videos at all, and, I don't know, who just haven't been here, you can go fuck off and, you know, unsubscribe. I don't give a shit. If you're not going to watch the videos, don't watch them. One thing that pisses me off the most, especially on my channel, but, you know, this goes across... A lot of other channels that I've seen also is that you subscribe to the channel and you don't watch their content. Why are you sub to them? It doesn't make any sense. You're just, I don't know. It, it's like a false number. It, it really pisses me off because I got 6,800 subscribers and now I'm getting around 50 to maybe a couple hundred views a video, and which is kind of irritating because I think I make some pretty fucking good content, especially in the last three or four months. The content's been really good on the channel. But, you know, you just got these people over here who are, are just not watching and it's kind of irritating. And I know back in the day, or not back in the day, but a few months ago when I was uploading the Vision videos, I was getting 1,000 plus views every single video. And everybody was subscribing, it was all good time. But since I stopped playing the Division, people stopped watching the channel. So if you guys don't want to watch the channel anymore, then just unsub. Do us all a favor, unsub. Uh, I'm prepared to watch that subscriber count go down. I've already started seeing it go down just a little bit, just because I've been doing other things in the channel, which also irritates me a little bit more. It's like, why do you subscribe to a channel when you don't expect to watch any videos from them? Uh, I personally subscribe to a channel for personality, not just because of, of one or maybe two videos they make. I'll watch, let's say, H3H3 Productions. I, I watched like maybe 15 videos of theirs before I actually subscribe to the channel. And made sure like, oh, I'm actually going to watch a ton of these guys. I've Since then, I've watched like probably 100 plus H3H3 production videos. And that goes across the second channel too, Ethan and Ela. Uh, and that was all within the last literal three weeks. I've watched over 100 of their videos. They're awesome people. But yeah, that was just an example of like, just subscribe to a channel for, for their personality, not just because of one video. And I, I think one video that a lot of people subbed to me from it was the Hacker interview, which was dumb video. I, I don't it doesn't even deserve a hundred thousand views let alone five thousand views 
So, I don't know. That's just my two thoughts on it. And, I don't know. Just thank you guys for the people who have been supporting the channel lately. You guys are the MVPs, and I appreciate it. But, yeah, just expect more fun to be uh, coming to the channel more. Maybe more IRL kind of stuff. I know in a few weeks, I'll be uh, live streaming a build for my PC. I'm getting a new uh, CPU, motherboard, and RAM. And I'll probably have to clean out that PC anyways from dust and all that stuff. I cleaned it out like a few weeks ago, but... I need to re-clean it, of course, when I put the new parts in. That'll be kind of fun. So I'll be, I'll be, uh, I'll have Bros for Lives over. He'll be streaming it with me of me building my PC. Thinking about doing it outside, and then moving it inside. I don't know. It'll be streamed from the phone, so that'll be pretty fun stuff. But that's practically I wanted to, all I wanted to talk about in this video. Just the RGB situation. That you know that happened literally like four hours. No, not even four hours ago. Like an hour and a half ago. Okay, not even an hour. It was an hour ago. Oh my god. That's insane. So that kind of sucks. We're going to have to get new ones of those. And then I also talked about the... Oh my god, what else? Oh, the future of the channel, I guess. You know, some stuff kind of like that. And then also the, you know, the people who stop watching my videos. I don't know. Whatever. Ah, that, guy, that stuff just pisses me off, though. The, uh... People who sub to you and then they just... Nobody watches. Like, what the, what the hell? What, what, are, what are you doing? Just, just, just go then. <laughs> if you're not going to watch the videos, but... Yeah, those of you who have been supporting me, I appreciate that. You guys are the real MVPs, just remember that. And I guess I'm just going to call that a video. I want to bring more fun to the channel. That's ultimately the reason why I made this video in the first place. So, let's hope I can do that. And hopefully you guys will keep watching for all that fun stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you guys liked it, don't forget to drop a like on it. And also, smash that subscriber button only if you're, you know, wanting to watch my amazing content. And yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I will see you guys in the next video.